What's up everybody, my name is Vince. Welcome to the channel and today we have a slightly damaged box here from Cobalt. You know what that means. If you do, leave it down in the comment section below. But what we have here is product number 0856457. It is something I needed. It's a combo kit. It's got a string trimmer, which I'm super excited about, as well as a leaf blower. So let's get this thing opened up right after this message. So it's pretty cool. It's got a five year tool warranty and it's got a three year battery warranty. You know, it's pretty funny. It's got 30 minutes of max run time with a, only a four amp hour battery. As you can see down here, the 24 volt motor system is available in these tools with many more to come, a lot more to come. Matter of fact, what you can do is go on over to this video right here. We talk all about Cobalt, what they're gonna be doing at Lowe's. Are they, are they leaving Lowe's? We answer the question about this 24 volt platform, go and check it out. Now, it's got up to 30 minutes of max runtime. It's lightweight, lightweight, like Ronnie Coleman used to say, still says. You know, one of the crazy things about the, the Cobalt 24 volt max system is, people ask me all the time, what does that mean 24 volt max? It run 24 volts? That's their max one fully charged. That's the max amount the battery pack will charge to, 24 volts, but it runs nominal voltage, 21.6 volts. It's kind of like a two by four. Is it really two inches by four inches? Leave it down in the comment section below. So you can see the leaf blower's got adjustable auxiliary handle, rubber overmold, handle grip, safety start button, pretty cool, variable speed trigger, brushless motor right here in the head of the tool, dual string line feed. You know, I have such a tough time reloading the string on my string trim trimmer. And the prices on these combo kits are so good that I, maybe I shouldn't even try to reload the string anymore. Maybe I should just like buy a new string trimmer every time. What do you think? Nah, it's definitely be crazy. The leaf blower's got rubber over mold handle grip, cruise control switch. Pretty cool, cruise control. Variable speed trigger, removable blower tube, and a brushless motor. Let's see what other specifications we could see. The string trimmer, as we can see here, is of variable speeds between 5,800 and 7,100 RPMs. The cutting swath is 12 inches. The line diameter is 0 0.08 inches. The operating weight 7.6 pounds. The blower has a variable speed trigger as well. It moves 410 cubic feet per minute. The air speed's at 100 miles per hour, and the operating weight is 6.8 pounds. Battery's four amp hours. The charger is 45 watts. Charges included battery in 165 minutes. Pretty cool. Let's get this thing unboxed. So I can tell you what I think about it. Whoa. So, the string trimmer is gonna require a little bit of assembly. I think what we should do is Get the biggest components out of the box and out of the way first. It's got a nice feel, nice rubber overmold. Switch feels good. The good part is this cruise control switch, okay? It doesn't like lock it, for instance, in full on. It doesn't need to be in full on. This cruise control switch will lock it to whatever speed in between, obviously, in between off and the max that you want it. Does that make sense? Like, you know, you can't like use this button to get turbo boost. It will just lock it wherever you want it in between the tool's range. For all you smart Alex in the comments section, you slide your tube down and then twist to lock it on. Here's the charger and the battery. It's gonna be like one of them cooking shows. So this is your four amp hour battery from Cobalt. The good thing about Cobalt tools is, is that if you need spare batteries, and you will because 
Combo kits only come with one battery, it seems. I know they're cheap, they're inexpensive, the batteries, but why not throw an extra one in the kit? I'm just hashtag just saying. Not trying to be a negative Nelly. You got the battery and the charger here. And if you wanted to see how long this battery takes to charge on this charger, you could go to this video here. This battery's most likely, let's see here. Oh, it does have half a charge. So we could pop it on the leaf blower. Whoa. How's that feel, Nick? Feels, uh... What we could do is, we could probably do a more in-depth review in the future where we actually take these tools outside into the wilderness. Let us know if you want us to take these tools outdoors. Here's the dreaded Allen key that's included. That's good. But whenever you see an Allen key, it lets you know that some assembly is required. We could opt to read the directions right away, or we could kind of wing it. Okay, so the main tool. Pretty much comes in a single piece. You close this down. Ooh. So the original screws here, they're security screws. But the screws provided are just an Allen key. So, two things. You notice that when I, I, I put the handle on, okay, I, I adjusted it up and down by using my arms where I would feel most comfortable. You know, I'm gonna be doing most of my weed whacking or string trimmering at this height, right? So, I wanna set the handle so that my arm can be fully extended. You know, I don't wanna have to be bending over or, or like holding it up in the air to, to weed whack in that, at that height. Set your handle to where you need it. Now, let's just say somebody else wants to use the tool. All you gotta do is open up this lever, back off the thumb screw, okay? and then they could adjust the handle up and down and use it so that they're comfortable. I'm gonna throw the four amp hour battery on the tool, okay? Just to, to see how it feels. Whoa! I gotta tell you, that sounds powerful. And I feel like tools that sound powerful, then tap the like button. Also, if this is your first time here, you're gonna wanna get subscribed because we do cool unboxing videos like this all the time. What you also wanna do is head down to the comments section below. You wanna see us do a full review where we take this thing outdoors and maybe Whack some weeds and blow some leaves. Leave it down in the comments section below. Cause you know, we'll do it.
With that, I want to say, I appreciate every single one of you being here. Yo, thanks for being here doing this unboxing. I was kind of, you know, excited because of the box damage. Leave it down below. What does it mean when you see box damage? Later, everybody. Video's over, but I know you want more. So this is how you're going to get it. First thing you need to do is pretend you're this guy. And you're here at the birthplace of freedom. Now ring that bell like it's 1776 and let all notifications through. What? You're not subscribed yet? Well, smash this button here. After that, watch this video here, here, and maybe over here. See you later.